Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi everyone. Welcome to our Year 3 English PDPR lesson. Today, we are going to focus on writing skill. Before we start our lesson today, let us look at the learning objectives for today's lesson. Number one, by the end of today's lesson, you will be able to complete rules correctly. Number two, by the end of today's lesson, you will be able to use capital letters, apostrophes, and full stops in writing class rules. Now, how about the success criteria for today's lesson? Let us look at the success criteria for today's lesson. Number one, by the end of today's lesson, you have to make sure that you can read the rules. Number two, you have to make sure that you can complete the sentences. And number three, you have to make sure that you can make class rules. Are you all ready for the lesson? Let us begin our lesson. You may refer to your Get Smart Plus 3 on page 69. Quiet. Don't take photos. Don't. D O N apostrophe T is the short form for do not. Let us read the rules once again. Be quiet. Don't take photos. Now, I would like to ask you, do you have any rules at home? I'm sure you have rules to follow at home. For example, clean your room. Do your homework. Don't watch TV after 9 o'clock. When you have the rules with you, you have to make sure that you follow all the rules to be good in your life. Next, I would like to mind the rules and I want you to guess what is the rules. Number one. What do you think? Yes, don't eat or drink. Number two. What do you think? Don't run. Number three. What is the rule? Don't Take photos. Lastly, what is the rule? Yes, you are right. Don't talk. Let us look at the symbols for the rules. Number one, we have don't eat. Number two, throw rubbish in the rubbish bin. Number three, the symbol, shh, be quiet. Number four, turn off your mobile phones. Lastly, the symbol of don't take photos. Now, let us complete the sentences. Number one, don't eat 
in class. Number two. Throw rubbish in the rubbish bin. Number three. Shh. Be quiet in the hospital. Number four. Turn off your mobile phones in the cinema. Number five. Don't take photos in the museum. Before we end our lesson today, let us look at the classroom rules. Let me give you example of classroom rules. Number one. Don't eat in class. When you write the classroom rule, don't eat in class, you have to make sure that you start the sentence with capital letter. Here, that is capital D. Don't forget to put apostrophe after the letter N and before the letter T. And please end the sentence with full stop. Don't eat in class. Full stop. Number two. Don't run in the classroom. Remember, every time you start the sentence, please use capital letter. Here, we start the sentence with capital D. And don't forget to put apostrophe in between the letter N and T. And end the sentence with full stop. Don't run in the classroom. Full stop. Another example of classroom rule is throw rubbish in the rubbish bin. I hope you will always remember that when you start every sentences, please start with capital letter. Here, we start with capital T. Throw rubbish in the rubbish bin. Full stop at the end of every sentences. Alright, I hope by now you enjoy your English PDPR lesson for today. See you in the next class. Bye-bye!